KFC has chicken nuggets. I'm gonna let you know if they are worth your money and time in this food review. Let's go. What is going on everyone and welcome to my channel. I am Nick the Mile High Food Dude. I am on my way to pick up the KFC chicken nuggets, which people are just kind of, you know, uh, pretty excited about. I've never had nuggets from KFC. I don't even think I've had chicken tenders from KFC. I don't know if they have chicken tenders. I've only had their sandwich and then the snack wraps, which were not very good. If you're wondering what those are like, go check out my YouTube short that I did on them. Uh, it was kind of a, a not so great experience, but their chicken sandwich was delicious. I actually hit that against the Popeye sandwich a few months back and KFC actually won. So I have high hopes for this. A lot of people are saying good things. They say they're very peppery, which I love in a crispy chicken. And yeah, I'm, I'm probably gonna get some fries because a lot of people are sleeping on their fry game. Those are really good. I don't know if I'm gonna get any regular chicken. I might just have to go back and do a regular KFC chicken review, but yeah. Have you tried the chicken nuggets yet from KFC? Let me know in the comment section below and then we're gonna be coming up on KFC here. Real short, we're gonna be doing uh, just the chicken nuggets. I think some of the sauces and some fries. So stay tuned. All right, so I got the KFC chicken nuggets. They are secured. Nice packaging on there. I got the combo meal, which was $9.99. It comes with their french fries, which a lot of people are sleeping on. And then Honestly, I'm so hyped up from Sugar from last night. I went and saw the new Mario movie, and so I had Sprite, I had Butterfingers, so I'm just getting a water today. Aquafina, good choice. Comes with the biscuits, and then I got all of their sauces. Now, the sauces do cost 29 cents a piece, but I wanted to try all five of them. I also got buttery spread, honey, hot sauce, ketchup. I mean, he literally gave me everything. Now, I did arrive right at 10 a.m. when they're opening. So I went through the drive-thru. I was going to kind of film me going through the drive-thru. Dead silence. I'm not joking. I was sitting there for about five minutes. So I had to park, go in. The doors were actually locked at like 10.05. And I get it. I'm that person. I'm the one who shows up right when doors open. People are a little bit discombobulated. So I apologize, KFC. Uh, but also, you know, be ready at 10 a.m. if you open at 10 a.m. So I'm going to try their biscuit first. We're going to just kind of break it open here. Ooh, nice and fluffy on the inside. We put some buttery spread on there. All right. Buttery spread. I don't think I've ever had this before in my life. <laughs> Cheers. I can't believe it's not butter. <laughs> mm. It's not overly flavorful. I'm not loving the biscuit. I don't know if they're famous for their biscuits or not. Tell me down in the comment section below, are they famous for their biscuits? Put a little honey on there. I'm sure it's real organic, natural honey as well. Hmm. It's actually a lot better with the honey. I don't think I need to finish this. That's okay. Right, they're French fries. Take a look at that. Yeah. Yeah, French fries are good. And I have really good seasoning on there, nice and crunchy. I didn't see anyone in the back using a fryer, so they've probably been ready for a hot minute, but they're still they still taste fresh. Put a little bit of ketchup smear on there. These are legit. I don't know if KFC is getting enough recognition for their fries, but they're pretty solid. All right, now what we've all been waiting for are chicken nugs. So taking a look at one, it's got good texture on there. I like that. They're not huge. I am seeing a little bit of the pepper flakes on there, but we're gonna give it a try without any sauce first. Mmm. Yeah, okay. 
You can really taste the 11 herbs and spices that they claim to have on their chicken. It's actually not bad. Not, not a bad chicken nugget. All right, let's try their KFC sauce. I'm assuming this is gonna be very similar to any type of other sauce. Uh, name brand, you know, we have cane sauce, we have Chick-fil-A sauce. Everybody that does crispy chicken has their own sauce. Mmm, stings the nostrils. All right, here we go. That's what she looks like. Mmm. It's very tangy. Almost um, like a ton of vinegar, like pickle juice in there. Some would say it's zesty, all right? Not bad. Let's go with their honey mustard. I'm not really a big mustard fan. I like spicy mustard on like a bratwurst, but we'll, not really on my chicken. All right, honey mustard. <laughs> it's not bad. It's not my favorite. I don't love mustard and chicken together. Do you like honey mustard with your chicken? Is that your go-to sauce? Let me know in that comment section. All right, we're gonna go with ranch next. My son is obsessed with ranch. He could dip anything in ranch. I've never been a huge ranch person. I like it. I like it with croutons and on a salad, but with my chicken and pizza, I'm a purist. All right, ranch on the nug. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, that was good. <laughs> you might have changed my mind on this one, KFC. The ranch with the nugs, really, really nice. Moving down the line, we have the buffalo ranch. I love buffalo sauce. Am I gonna love it with ranch? Maybe, we'll see. But, oh my gosh, I could eat buffalo sauce with chicken tenders and chicken nuggets any day of the week. All right, next nug up, in with the buffalo. Oh yeah, I like that. Hmm. The buffalo ranch doesn't taste like ranch, which is okay with me, like I said. I just enjoy that bite with the ranch, but the buffalo sauce, it almost just seems like a really creamy buffalo sauce. And I'm okay with that. That was really, really good. All right, last of the sauces, we have the honey barbecue. I generally, whoops, squirted all over me. I should call her. I love barbecue sauce with crispy chicken. So same thing with buffalo. I can do the same thing with barbecue as well. So we dip, get all up in there, yeah. All right, that's what she looks like. Mm. I don't know that I love the KFC barbecue sauce. All right, I love barbecue sauce. Like I said, this one I'm not feeling as much. All right, we're gonna try the hot sauce and then we're gonna try a little bit of the honey with it and then we'll conclude our review. All right, so a little bit of that KFC hot sauce. I don't know if this is traditional Kentucky style hot sauce here, but cheers. Mm. Yeah, it's really good. Nice and vinegary. I actually really like that hot sauce. Back with the honey packet. There is my chicky nug. Dripping with that honey. Ooh. That was good. I'm gonna do a little honey. A little bit of hot sauce together. That was a good combo. I think my favorite sauce was the buffalo ranch. I like that honey and hot sauce combo I just did. And the ranch was pretty solid as well. And I'm not usually a ranch person. I ate all eight. <laughs> but yeah, they're not bad. They actually taste pretty good. As far as fast food crispy chicken goes, I'd probably give them a 2.8 out of five. A lot of really nice spices on the chicken itself. You could pick your favorite condiment. Doesn't matter to me, you're not gonna hurt my feelings. And the fries are solid.
If you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up, smash that subscribe button, and turn on the bell notifications. I actually upload food reviews almost every single day, usually in YouTube shorts. I am located in Denver, Colorado, so I know a lot of the local spots not a lot of you are aware of, and that's okay. That's why I come to chain restaurants. I'll do fast food. I'll do trending snacks and things like that. So if that sounds like something that you're into, please consider subscribing to my channel. Thank you so much for watching. Are you going to be trying the KFC chicken nuggets? Let me know in the comment section below, and make sure to subscribe if you love food reviews. <laughs>